detail. So we can even see that there's uh, an advancement on that. possible, but it's not legal. Possible.
over in the Santa Susanas, a couple little gaps down by the river by Bristol Park. Uh, but it's pretty interesting how much is already in public ownership. This is a zoom in on those gaps over in the, the um, around the Simi Valley. Some of these may or may not, you know, uh, Rancho Simi area north of 118 may have missed some of that, but uh, just gives you a sense. And we and the idea of you see the reservoir in the bottom left hand side of the screen that's Bard Reservoir. The original trail didn't go around to the left of it, but uh, it necessitates creating an option going around that way in order to probably come up with a trail that will work on this. Well, yeah. Is this an outgrowth of the original Bard Pinehill Trail? It is. This is this uh, pretty much that red line you see there. That's Rory can probably describe it better. Mostly around the San Fernando Valley, and then expanded into the. Well, in 1984, the original legislation uh, that Mark Fine was promoted um, was the, sort of the, the central red area, but the spurs out to Sierra Madre and Santa Clarita, those pavements after the 1990s, which are past legislation. Just a, a zoom in of. Uh, Seven slides, and then I'll tie it up. The uh, pink color is the original 1990 Dangerman Trail map on the uh, USGS map, and then this black line is the best we could come up with something that worked, that was walkable, and uh, had the least cost. And you can see how much of a deviation there is there between Glendale and the Cable Canyon area. A lot of it had to do with a shooting range being put in right where the, the middle of where the, the trail had to go. <laughs> That's just not going to work. <laughs> uh, so I don't know. So what I think my idea was is that we would send out a KMZ to people to look and see, hey, what, what, uh, on Google Earth, does this layer work for your area? Do you have any um, input? And start to build a better layer. Because the sooner this gets out to where people can use it, the better. And there are portions of, I'll show you where, for instance, in Calabasas, I didn't realize the Rim of the Valley Trail went through the Calabasas Commons parking lot. Oh, it's a, it's a Google Earth file that you just press on when you have Google Earth open, and it downloads into the Google Earth, and it puts the trail right on there. You can zoom in, zoom out, and it's part, it's part of your, your, uh, your tool. This is the far, the far eastern end. Uh, that whole addition there on that Mount not was added. I'm not sure why. Uh, but the beauty is there's so many great trails in the Angeles National Forest that it works. Probably the, one of the biggest deviations was that in, uh, in uh, originally the trail went through Legion Park in that area, and on the uh, uh, west side of I-5 in this area, but too much has been chopped up. But really the way to go now is the only continuous path is to use the LA River bike lane. So that was something that, you know, had, this is the first time anyone's seen this in print, just said, you know, you need to do that. And along the Royal Seco there, uh, Pretty, pretty good connections, a lot of good material to work with as far as putting the trail together. It's phenomenal. And they all lead down to where the, the confluence is there. Whoops, this is the wrong slide. Oh, what happened on the, road, the trail, the El Pueblo, the Griffith Park Trail, that was originally um, went to Legion Park, is there's this one segment on Riverside Drive there. The city council approved a apartment complex that ruined this trail. I mean, we, we were there lobbying and the mayor, the mayor, through every ball is waiting to help him develop it. We had a perfect trail on Wildlife Forest and Griffith Park and Legion Park. Mm -hmm. And that's a piece of that wildlife corridor that more or less modeled at the trail. When was that ball approved? Ah, uh, I think three years ago. Three. Two and a half. It was very painful. Uh, here just a, here's an example of where uh, life in the center of the screen below Hidden Hills. Trail goes uh, originally was right through the Calabasas Commons 